fuck is the shovel? Find a spade. Apparently down here. A bit further down. We can find one. Man, why does it take me so long to find a shovel? When you guys played this game, did it also take you guys a long time to find the shovel? Ah, oh, the coal burner. The coal burner had to have a shovel, right? Kunesh. Or, or what was his name? Kuresh. Kunesh. Kunesh. Find, finding a shovel is the is the main quest line. Oh, I see. I see. The whole game is just about finding the shovel. Look, they didn't burn all this down. They didn't burn down the tavern or anything. Stable's still fine. Salvageable. Should be able to do something with it. Can't actually go into some of these places. Look. It's fine. I heard somebody. I heard, I heard a, a cry. I'm sure I just heard a cry. It's a dog! Where are you, you mangy mutt? Where's this dog? He's over here somewhere. What? Somebody's fighting a dog over here. I wonder, are all my friends dead? They must be, right? Who needs help? I've got a sword. I can help. How the hell do I get in here? Are they in here? No. What the fuck? I'm like on the other side here. I'm coming. Don't worry, I'll save your life. Oh, we're getting a cutscene. Maybe it's Fritz. Good old Fritz. Get away, you mutt! Oh, it's the it's the Dutch guy. He's got a shovel too. Get away, you beast! Don't you dare! What's going on? That's my Lisa, dog. What in God's name are you doing? What do you think I'm doing? Digging turnips? The beast just went for me. He's a dog killer. Isn't that the butchers. Isn't that body the butchers? Yeah, that's him. What's that got to do with anything? Look, just give me the shovel, you son of a bitch. I need it right now. Do you want me to put the dog down? I've got Excalibur here. He's protecting his master. I'd say the poor creature is standing guard over his master. You weren't trying to get to him, were you? What do you care what I'm doing? What are you doing? I'm just doing a little bit of looting as well. I want to bury my parents. Came to bury my parents. So bury them and leave me be. Okay, can I have the shovel? Would you lend me that spade? I have to dig a grave and I can't find another. What's it worth to you? I see you have a fine sword. Oh my god. I'll gladly trade you my spade for that. How did you come by it anyway? Are you fucking serious? Fine. I'll take the spade and you can have the sword. You can have it right up your ass. Nice. You think you can talk that way just because you've got a sword? Hell yeah, Bullshit. baby. I don't know much about sword fighting. Suits me. I'll knock your teeth in then. I'm gonna cut this guy up. Another fist fight, huh? You're messing ro with the wrong guy today. You, you know what? Shit, Fuck. shit. Yeah, that's, that's right. right. Turn tail and run, you bastard! You fucking asshole. Check it. Hold up a second. Oh, I missed. <laughs> oh, shit, I wanted to hit him so bad, too. Fuck! Alright. Where was that alleyway that we were just down? It was like over here, wasn't it? What? Wait, where the. Did it fucking teleport me? somewhere else to have the fight with him? Because he was in here. Oh no, we came out of here. Oh look, this is his dead friend. That's one of his friends. Fuck fist fighting in this game. It's the worst. There, there, boy. Where did the shovel go? Oh, it's right here. Good. 
Got it. What's wrong? You want an apple or something? Easy there, boy. You know me. Your good master won't be needing this anymore. Okay, fine. You just you just keep watch there. I won't loot him or anything. I don't want to kill the dog. Part of me is saying, you know what, maybe we should kill the dog, but at the same time, maybe we shouldn't kill the dog. Alright. Now where is our shovel? dig this grave they wanted they wanted to be buried underneath this bush here they are don't worry we're gonna get you guys buried under this bush you mark my words how are we gonna dig here it's full of rocks actually full of rocks or did they mean this tree back here oh uh, maybe maybe they actually meant this tree back here Oh, fuck, what's with all these fucking walls? Christ almighty. And I'm over encumbered again. It's time to eat a lot of bread. We're stuffed. We can't do it. We cannot do it. Is there anything that we can drop here? Do we have any extra? Let's drop this crappy sword. Wait. Okay, let's drop the crappy sword. Wait, that didn't give a shit actually. We got the ch the shield, the shield. Let's drop some of these torches. We don't need this many torches, right? We're carrying way too many torches. Okay, better. Okay, now we can finally run again. I think we have to go back up to where their house was and bury them under that tree. I hope we don't have to like do a mini game for the digging. I'm not in the mood. I'm really not in the mood. I think it's this tree here that they want to be buried under, not the bush. It looked like he was looking at that bush, but he wants to be... Martin and his wife want to be buried side by side underneath this tree. It makes sense, right? This is the tree that was just outside of their house. This is a good place. You're going to like it here. Do I actually have to do it? Where the fuck... Where is it? The spade. What the fuck, I can't equip the spade, boys. Okay, start digging. Got it. Hop in, Jerry. <laughs> This one's for you. Okay, dogs are good at digging too. I, I don't know why it doesn't just help. What? Guys, stop Bible thumping. It's just a dog. Let's get to it. You guys are the worst. I'll tell you what the great shame is. I bet you there's no mechanic in this game to rebuild this town and make it into our own pimped out palace. That's what you should be crying about. Not this stupid dog watching me dig a hole. Damn it all. How am I going to do this? 
Do you need some help? What the fuck? Is that him? Yes. Can't you see the sword? Oh, for fuck's sake. What do you want? Is Bishek? Who do you think we are? Franciscan brothers? <laughs> uh, more like sisters. Let's fucking rip you guys really a new one. you of everything you've got. Especially that fine blade that's of no use to a peasant like you anyway. Banish the thought. It is my father's sword. Oh, fucking have all of you. You mean him? First, I'm going to start with Hatchet Boy. Gonna be needing it. Have at you, bitch. Listen here, boy. You hand over that sword. I might just let you go. If not, you're in for a family reunion you really don't want. Leave me alone. Kill him, Runt. I cut the bastard down. As All right. Like. Fine. Could have just cost you a few teeth. Ah! What a dodge. You can't even really swing that thing. Okay, I think this might be the first boss, guys. Oh my god, it is. Oh my god, how did he swing that faster than I fucking stabbed him? Come on! Call the doggo casserole. Also, how is the casserole doing? I'm bleeding! Are you excited about Tread Dead Redemption 2? No, I'm not at that excited about it. Um, I mean, I'll try it, I guess, but... I'm, how am I... For fuck's sake! How does he swing fucking faster than I stab with a sword? I told you how it would end. You should have listened to This guy's a piece of shit as well, the guy in the green. This is nice work. The chief is going to like it. It's new, isn't it? And now, for the maiden bloodletting. Surely your father never would have imagined it would be your blood. I believe there's a word for such moments. We're gonna cut that guy's balls the off. The old man would certainly know. But I'm just a common killer. Did you help make it? No doubt you did. Such miserable luck. To die by the sword you helped forge. Hey, go fuckers! Uh oh. It's Teresa! <laughs> it's true, you guys do fuck goats. The games are over. Don't! Just burn this battle! Yeah, that's right. Give me my sword back, Teresa. Nice! Just in time. Thank the lords. I almost died there, boys. Maybe I, I could have killed him, but... Oh, shit. I lost the sword and I dropped the other one as well. That sucks. <laughs> I think I'm bleeding to death as well again. <laughs> Wait! Wait! That was the intro? Come on! We've been playing for like three and a half hours! <laughs> Fuck! Oh, God. Fuck. Did it take you guys three and a half hours to do the intro as well? Teresa's alive! And she called those guys goat fuckers. I'm in love with her now. I'm actually in love with her now. Dan Brown. Dan Brown. Dan Brown. Hey, Dad. Don't hey. forget about your tasty casserole num noms. What fish did the knights of old eat? Swordfish? Love you. Daddy -o. Thanks, it's Captain Disco. Hey, Brian Blessed's in, in this at some point. That's pretty good.
Wait, is this like time has passed and the wounds have healed and things are going back to normal or or what? Or in a, a different town? Tell me we're not back in Tamburg or whatever. Teresa's taking me out into the middle of nowhere to train me up to become a super warrior. That's got to be what it's all about, right? I'm ready to become a super warrior, I think. Thank you for playing Kingdom Come. We hope you enjoyed our game. <laughs> well done. Well done. Well done. <laughs> That's it. That's the end. We didn't we didn't do much deliverance in the end. We just sort of failed at a bunch of things and then now the game is over. Who the fuck is this? The head chef of the town. Teresa, why have you brought me here? To Brian's house of bagels. Homecoming. Okay. Oh shit, we're having another nightmare. It's another nightmare, boys. We have to save our parents. Where are they? That's not them. I can't see anything. Mom? Dad? Let's go. What's going on? Take this. Take that. Where are you? I can't see you guys anywhere. It's so dark. Creepy. I'm going to be plagued by these nightmares for the whole game now, aren't I? Because I wasn't able to save my parents. We discovered a fast travel point in the realm of nightmares. Nice. Now anytime we want to have a nightmare, we can just travel back there. Help? Oh shit. We're having nightmares about all of the bad shit that happened to us. No. Not that, not that gold fucker as well. It's a new day. Mom? Henry, can you hear me? That's not my mom. Hallelujah. I thought you'd never wake. Teresa. Are you having a nightmare? What did you do to my pants? Hmm. I still have a fever. Uncle won't be pleased, but you'll have to stay in bed. I discovered Miller. Hmm. <laughs> Miller time. What a discovery. Where am I? In Scalitz? We're at my uncle's mill in Rattay. I didn't know where else to go. Rattay? What happened? You don't remember anything? I suppose that's not surprising. I found you in Scalitz after those bandits attacked you. I thought they'd done for you. But you were still breathing. Why in heaven's name did you go back there? It was madness. They slaughtered everyone who didn't run. My I parents, wanted to rebuild the whole place. I wanted to bury them. I had to... I wanted to slowly Don't rebuild worry. the whole village over time. Thank you. Any good Christian would have done the same. Now sleep. You need your strength back. Alright. A few delirious days later, we discovered the Miller again. <laughs> that led to the delirium. Yeah, we're back. Good morning. It's near midnight. You've slept all day. Oh. <laughs> what a lucky oh, son of a bitch. Fell on me. The when was the last time you guys slept worse, till midnight? But at least the fever's broken. Like a big long day sleep? How did you find me? 
What were you doing there? What in the world were you doing in Scarlet? Waiting to die. What? They killed my brothers, my family, my friends. They're all dead? All of them. Everyone I ever loved. They killed one of my brothers in the mines. After that, what did I have to live for? Teresa, say that. I got some bad news for you. There's always hope. Everybody I know is dead no, there too. Isn't. Including but it doesn't matter. Bianca. I'm a now. How did you find me? How did you manage to save me? You were lucky. I was in Scalitz and I saw Zbyshek and his thugs. I tried to distract them, but it would have been no use if those soldiers from Tamburg hadn't arrived. They were searching for you and scattered the bandits. She, yeah, she has something to live for now, you're right. They were looking for me? Searching for me? Yes. Lord Divish sent them, led by Captain Robard. So tell me, why is a lord of such high standing interested in a blacksmith? So Divish promised Sir Radic he'd look after me. But as for why they should care, I've no idea. I'm tired. Oh, I'm exhausted. I'm not surprised. I'll bring you water and something to eat. In the meantime, rest. You're still very weak. Did I mention that Bianca is also dead? I found her dead. She's, she's dead and gone. No chance. Good morning to you. How's no the No chance today? of any attachments again. Ugh, I haven't felt as good as this since they lashed me to the wheel and quartered me on the town square. Got your sense of humor back. You must be better. My uncle will be glad to hear it. I had a job persuading him to let me bring you here. If you'd lain around much longer, he really would have dumped you on the town square. Oh my god. You can stay until you find somewhere else to live. But my uncle will want payment for taking you in and caring for you. Oh my god. Okay. Where am I again? And this is your uncle's house. We're in Rattay Mill. My uncle's Miller Peshek. He took me in and I talked him into taking care of you too. Okay, I've been lying around long I've enough. been lying here long enough. Train me. Let's Uncle do a will montage. Be pleased he's one mouth less to feed. But are you truly well enough? I'm fine. Well enough to do what has to be done. Where can I find Sir Radzig? I'll go get a he's job in at the tavern. He's in Castle in Perkstein. He's a guest of Sir Hannes of Leiper. But someone like you can't just walk up bold as you please and demand an audience. I know, Sir Radzig. And I didn't bring him his sword as I was supposed to. I must see him. If you insist... But you need to speak to my uncle first. Okay. You've been in your sick bed for a Does he have any bandits well, that need to be fought or anything? To tend to you and for medicine. That's a good deal of a coin you owe him. I've been lying here two weeks. My God. Two weeks! A fortnight in bed than an eternity in the grave. If it weren't for my uncle, you wouldn't be here at all. Okay. I have to get to work. Fine. But right now, I have more important things to do. That's all you have to say? After everything we've done for you? Uh-oh. Well, do as you see fit. <laughs> oh, whoops. I just wanted to get on with it, Teresa. Sorry. Look, Teresa, come on. Let's not leave like this, baby. Come on. Come on, don't... Be a bit more careful. I'm trying to talk Work to you. with you, young... Hey! What? Teresa, please. Get Father's sword back. Find Have out... Have you eaten yet? No. Yes, it was very good. Not yet. Not yet. Well, try to eat something. A big lad like you needs his strength. Haha. Okay. She doesn't want to know. I think I missed out on on potential for romance. Okay. Actually, let's see how hungry are we. <coughs> Pretty hungry, it turns out. Let's eat from the pot. That looked like baked beans. Mmm. My favorite. How are we doing now? Better. Better. We do have a whole bunch of... What's in here? <gasps> it's Bianca's... <laughs> Alright, we'll definitely take this. We're gonna need all of our gear. Look, all of our stuff is in here! Fantastic. We need a sword, though. We lost our, our one and only sword. Let's pick up this sweet pancake. And this one, too. And this one, too. That's a lot of sweet pancakes. Mmm. My favorite. What was he doing in here? What's up with the light here? It looks like we're on a spaceship. Alright, let's talk to this guy. He wants to talk to us. I've eaten now. A Hello. Word with you. I'm Henry. Thanks for taking care of me. My name's Henry. 
Thank you for taking care of me here. My name's Peshek, and I'm the miller here. You've already met my niece, Teresa. She took care of you for two whole weeks while you were in limbo. And talking of you being at death's door, while you were lying here, you worked on quite a bill with the blood letter. Who came now and again to keep you alive with his potions? Well. That quack doesn't come cheap. I paid him what I could, but I still, that is, you still owe him. Wow, so, okay, fine. Well, it's better to be in debt than to lie dead in a ditch. What do I owe? I'm not afraid of hard work. You won't pay for that shoveling manure. Come on, that's all I'm I good at. I have a better job for you. And it's not something any fool could do. Why are you giving you me the job, me, then? You're a clever lad. I might trust you with something you could really make money for. What do you say? Uh, what do you what, you want? You want me to set up a business? What would you need from what me? What would you need from me? A trifle. Just to take something from someone and bring it to someone else. Oh, I see. And not get caught while you're doing The rat hay underworld. That sounds straightforward enough. Sure. Except for not get caught. Why would anyone want to catch me? Oh, don't worry. It's just a job like any other. Only this one requires, uh... Let's say the right moral disposition. It's like a mafia. Do corpses bother you? No honorable man should touch them. That's the executioner's job. Did you expect I'd give you a hoe and send you out to the fields? You can dig all right, but somewhere else. I want to know whether you're going to hide behind some stupid fucking scruple. <laughs> or if you wow. might be useful for more unconventional work. Teresa's uncle is hardcore. Okay, tell me more. I'm prepared for just about anything, but that's a bit much. But go on. Tell me more. Listen, it's about this ring my mate, Wojcik, the Kohelnitz Miller, had his eye on. Trouble is, they buried the ring by the gibbet along with the villain they hung while he was wearing it. Jesus right, okay. Christ. You want me to dig up a corpse, take a ring from it, and give it to your friend in Kohelnitz? There's nothing sacred to you. Money first, morals later. That fellow is dead. Agreed. Whatever bleeding heart came up with the idea that it's disrespectful to disturb a corpse never read the Bible. It's still a human body, only it's missing a soul. Why be disgusted by something created by God? All right, sure. I think I've already heard more than I need to know. You've got the tongue of the devil himself. If you tried hard enough, I bet you could justify sodomy with a goat. Watch your mouth, boy. May on that subject, there's a shovel here around. You the might somewhere. need to justify. If there's any problem, come and see. Go. I have this. And issues. here's something on the side to make you dig better. Thanks. I'll need it. I can't believe I've come to this. Digging up corpses. Oh, and uh, watch out for the executioner and his hounds. They're pretty savage, and I don't just mean the dogs. You can just throw them some meat. The dogs, that is. But the executioner. Well, don't vex him. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Yes. Yes. Yes, I want all my stuff. Let's grab all this crap. We want most of it, if not all of it. We're going to need to take some of our food with us as well. Let's take the bread and the bread rolls. And what else is good? The roast duck. Let's take this roast duck as well. And maybe also a bit of cheese. Never leave home without your cheese. Okay. Weapons. Let's get this long distant arrow going as well. Bianca's ring. Here we go. The green shirt. The hunter's gloves, the padded armor, the mail collar, the padded coif, the plate cooters, my pants, and my boots. There. We're back. What's up, Teresa? I ate. I'd like to know. I want to ask about fancy a little walk. What are you up to? How would you like to, um, I don't know, come for a walk? I gotta go dig up a corpse. I'd like that very much, but I can't right now, Hal. Give me some time to settle in, will you? If that's what you want. Fuck. It's not you, Hal. It's just this isn't a good time. Yeah, I get it. I get it. 
Time to go dig up a corpse Look then, I guess. Going. Teresa. Fucking son of a bitch. Fucking son of a bitch. Okay, where are we right now? We're in Rate. We have to go to Perkstein to see Radzig. And we also have to get the dead man's ring from Miller Peshek. It's this way. All right. Cool. Let's go. We're going. What Oblivion mod is this, Hildgrim? It's um, it's the new, it's the new Oblivion expansion. Oblivion didn't look as nice as this, did it? Or did it? Maybe it did actually. I remember it being pretty nice when I first played it, first ever played it, but that was a long time ago. Thanks, um, thanks for the two bucks, man. I appreciate it. All right, this dead man should just be buried over here. We brought some roast duck with us as well, and possibly, oh yeah, here we go. We're eating somebody else's food, why not? Why not? We'll have to keep our strength up. The graphics are super nice in this game, look at this. Okay, where's this dead man? Buried. Oh, beyond the wood. We're gonna have to go through the woods. Can we actually just wander through the woods? Or is it gonna be like a... Oh, you can! Okay, no, <laughs> you can't. Wait! Or can you? No, the hill is too steep. Wait, or can you? We did it! Oh, you can! But wait, this hill might be too steep for us now. It doesn't look that steep though. I thought it was going to be like an invisible wall sort of thing, but it doesn't look like it is actually. Looks like we could just like beeline straight here. There's a little house coming up here too. Okay, let's see who lives here. Bearing in mind, I don't have a sword on me right now. Oh, I see. Is this where they keep all the dead bodies? The dead body storage area? Sure. We'll figure it out. We should be fine. Yes, this game is huge. It does seem pretty huge, actually, yeah. Oh. Hey, what's hey. up? What's that noise? That's my dog! It's just me! What's up? You need some help? Yeah. I... Let me wash myself first. Hang on a second. There, now I'm ready to talk to you, Executioner Herman. How's it going? Um, try to get him out of the house. Miller Peshek sent me. He's very sorry. But by mistake, he didn't give you the full weight of flour last time. He says you should come and get the balance. But I never bought any flour from him. Oh. I've got a feeling you're trying to fool me. Oh, All no. All you want is to snoop around here. Why would Clear I want to do that? I the dogs on you. Oh, we got off to a wrong start. Okay, fine. We're going to have to find another way. Fuck. There goes that plan down the toilet. Shit. I just, you're right, I did want to have a snoop around. I was looking to snoop. Okay, maybe if we keep him in the house. We discovered Gallows Hill. Nice. This is where all the executions take place. Alright, where did you, where did he bury this guy? Let's get a, a better view here. Let's see. Okay. There's a, there's a grave. Looks like... Oh, we didn't get the shovel, did we? We're gonna have to take one from him. Alright. We don't have a spade. Let's see if we can steal one from in here somewhere. What? Best sneak skills EU? I know. I'm fully in character, sneaking around like a, like a madman as well. He's gotta have a shovel, right? Because he would have dug the grave in the first place. So all we gotta do is... Aha! Okay. Fuck, this might be easier than I thought actually, boys. Look at this. Found the grave as well. We can we can dig it up. I bet you as soon as we start digging, he's gonna come running out. Hey! Hey you there, stop snooping around my graves! Dogs! Take him down! Maybe we just have to kill the executioner. Maybe we can snipe him from up here. One to the dome is all it would take, I think. 
Okay, it looks like maybe he's gone to bed. Maybe we do it at night. Oh, shit, guys. I know what to do. Let's wait around until nighttime. Here we go. There, he'll be in bed and then we can just dig it up. Stand in a, f in a field for seven hours. Why not? All right. We got a whole bunch of food with us, so if we're hungry after all of this waiting, should be fine, right? Oh my god, it's dark as fuck. <laughs> There's some valerian here. <laughs> nice. Okay, let my eyes adjust a little bit. Okay, where's the grave now? Start digging. He's gotta be asleep, right? Okay, I found the body. Let's open it up. Christ, wound, what a fucking stink. How long have you been lying here? Nothing on the left hand. The right? Oh shit, there's nothing there either. Where the fuck is that ring? <coughs> oh, a stench makes me want to puke. Peshek will pay for this. Oh my god, okay. Let's cover up the evidence now. Too late, we can't. Alright, I came all the way out here and it doesn't look like the ring is on there. Fuck, it's nighttime now too. Maybe the woods are filled with werewolves at night. Hold up, let me get my torch. I have a torch still, right? That's better. Now I can actually see something. Fuck, maybe this guy isn't even buried yet. Maybe he's in here. wash ourselves. <laughs> okay, let's get the fuck out of here, actually. But before we go, let's steal this axe. Because I don't have a weapon right now. Can't steal it. Okay. Can I fast travel now? Should be able to fast travel, right? Yeah. Fast travel. Yes. No. <laughs> oh, wow, the fast travel is amazing. Okay, we discovered... Rate. <laughs> nice. Okay. We've also discovered the mill. Alright. Peshek, where are you? Do you sleep up here? Do you sleep up in here? You savage? Tell me you don't. We're sneaking through our... Teresa? <laughs> oh, maybe we can like fart in her face a little bit while she's sleeping. Old man Teresa, are you up here? <laughs> he is. Fuck, this is great. He's sound asleep. Should we steal from him? Ah, oh, fuck. We can we can knock people out when they're asleep. Uh, leave me be. I want to sleep. <laughs> fuck. Uh, we can actually knock them out. Um, I, I, unfortunately, my face is like in the way, <laughs> so you can't see the options. Sorry about that. Oh shit. Okay. We should also get some sleep now. That was some that was some real stinky work, wasn't it? Let's sleep a bit. In our full armor. Okay. How long are we gonna sleep for? With the torch burning. Let's sleep until let's sleep until morning. <laughs> Why does it go so slow? Move my face. I moved it, it's fine. <laughs> sleep has been launched. We've fully launched sleep. Okay, it should be sort of morning now. It is. Fuck, all these sleepy heads. They're still asleep. Teresa? Uh, what? No, go away. Drop into pot. 
Oh, you can poison stuff, I think. That's awesome. Remember to eat your sweet pancakes to celebrate Pancake Day. That's so that you have the strength to eat Teresa's sweet pancakes. Yes. Good fucking idea. I'm eating them right now. Our pants highlighted. Maybe it's because we just shit in our pants. We might have actually just shit in our pants. Where's the other ring? We had Bianca's ring. But didn't we have a, another ring? Or did we not? Maybe not. Maybe I'm wrong about this. Okay, let's not have this. But let's make sure that we have the shield. And we have our bow and arrow ready as well. Okay. Look, what a beautiful sunrise. Oh. Oh. It's another beautiful day in, at the mill. The sun is slowly rising. And everybody is waking up from their deep slumber. Teresa, still fast asleep. Wake up, Teresa. I'm gonna need to grab some of these bandages. Oh, fuck, I took everything. I did not want to do that. I did not want to do that. I don't want to take these carrots with me. Door keys? Yes. Dried fruit? Not at all. Let's leave the green shirt here too. We don't need that. These horseradishes can go in too. Kunesh's keys can go in. We don't need those. Long distance arrow. Nettle. Don't even know what it does. Let's leave this crap here. These pears. Uh, let's keep the arrows with us. Pretzels, we're gonna leave behind as well. The red scarf. Save your schnapps and schnapps. Spade, we'll hang on to. Torch, trunk keys, valerian. Okay. We're back to normal now. When are you guys gonna wake up? Fuck! How long does a guy have to wait? God, not go like a little bit faster. Shit. Two hours we're waiting for them to wake up. Okay, it's like 7.30 in the morning now. Fucking unbelievable. How do you guys make a living? Aha, he's awake. All right, Pilchner. I did your dirty deed. And guess what? There was no ring there. What the fuck? God be with you. There was a corpse in the grave, but no ring. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> Easy, Hal. Hold your horses. If the ring wasn't on the corpse, now I'm in the, the way of the dialogue. Have taken it before he buried the body. I can see where this is going. You want me to get the ring from the executioner? Clever lad. Only I wouldn't recommend talking to him about it. He's a bit touchy on the subject of robbing the dead. It'd be better to pinch it from his house. <sighs> Fine. All right, I'll go and find that ring. It should be in a trunk somewhere in the house. And look here, Henry. Do you know how to get past the lock? Get Do past I? the lock? You mean jemmy it off with a crowbar? No, you don't. I mean the delicate, gentle art of opening it quietly and with sensitivity, like popping a young maiden's cherry. I can pick a lot. I have some experience. <laughs> All right. I'm glad to hear you're not as clumsy as you look. Oh, my God. Here's a lockpick for the job. Thanks. <laughs> Fuck me. What this is guy, it? This guy is hardcore. Fuck. It's like the dad we never had. Let's just casually punch the ladder now as well. Teresa, your uncle taught me a lot about popping a young maiden's cherry with a lockpick. And I intend to do just that. Peace. We have to find this guy's house. Wait, it's this guy again. Don't tell me we have to wait until nightfall again. I will shit the bed. I will I will shit the bed. He wants you to sex her niece. No, I don't think he wants that actually, guys. I know that that's what you guys want, but I'm pretty sure that's not what he wants. He literally just wants his cock ring back. 
And we're, we're gonna go get it. Ew. It's all sticky and smelly. Where's this cock ring been? Ew. How far away is this? I thought it was just gonna be here. Where's this fuck? It is this fucker. It's this fucker's house again. Oh, fuck. Okay, we're gonna have to wait for the cover of darkness again before we can do this. I kind of like this quest. It's neat. It's a neat one. Climb, you fool. <laughs> Climb. Climb up! Oh, for fucks. Come on, Henry. What a fucking asshole. What a big dumb asshole. Now we gotta navigate our way up here again as well. Shit on it. It's it's good though, guys. We're getting we're getting familiar with the lay of the land. It's an important thing to do in a big open world RPG, much like Skyrim. Like this. You have to learn the lay of the land. You have to know where the slopes are. You gotta know when to hold them and know when to fold them. You gotta know when to walk away after the dealing's done as well. These are all important things that you need to know when you're playing a video game like this. Also, the, the plan is to lock this guy in the crapper. I like that you can look down and see your legs and arms and stuff. That's nice. Not a lot of games do that. Okay. We're gonna have to be really sneaky here. We have to sneak into this guy's house without the dog seeing us. Okay, let's sneak around the back here. Bah! No. 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 You didn't see me, dog. He thinks I'm over there still. No! <laughs> Come on, out of the way. <laughs> out of the way! What are you doing there? I'm fisting your pig! Hey, Fuck! Hey, no! No! Okay. Let's hide back in the shadows. We'll try it from a different angle. Fuck. We might have to take this guy out. I mean, we could break in while he's sleeping. That seems like the logical thing to do, but it's like a hard mode doing it while he's awake, right? It could be more fun. Describe this game to me, chat. Looks like Discount Oblivion at first glance. Uh... It, it, truth, truth be told, it is actually pretty good. Like, if you like an open world RPG, kind of like, it is a bit like, it reminds me more of Skyrim than it does uh, The Witcher. But there's no magic or anything in it. It's just, you know, it's not like medieval fantasy. It's like, at least there's no magic yet. So it's a bit more, I guess, like hardcore. It's pancake day. Yeah. Yes, it's pancake day. Happy yes, birthday, it's everybody. Pa, 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 pancake day. Some real old school British comedy for you, Sipsy. For tis the day of pancakes. Thanks. Enjoy. Thanks XO, XO. so much, Castaras. Yeah, happy pancake day to you and yours and everyone else as well. I hope you have a happy pancake day. I, myself, ate some pancakes for breakfast this morning. And guess what's for lunch and dinner as well, guys? That's right. Pancakes. It's gonna be good. Okay. Okay. It's impossible. He's got three dogs. He has three fucking dogs. If you can believe that. Okay. There's only one thing for it, boys. We're gonna do this the only way I know how. That's right. We have to go in at night. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna have to wait here for 14 fucking hours. Holy shit. This is the long wait. We're doing a full stakeout. We're doing a full stakeout on this guy now.
It had to be done, guys. I know you're questioning me right now. Big time. But look, our nourishment and energy levels, they're fine. We've got some pancakes on us. Oh, no, wait. I ate all the pancakes. Hold on a second. There is some roast duck, though. Okay. Let's revitalize with a bit of roast duck. Okay. Do we need the torch? I'm going to say no. We don't. Old Eagle Eyes Malone here. Are you fucking kidding me? Come on! There's a fucking dog right there. Last time he was perfectly asleep. What the fuck? Let's get the torch. We're gonna have to sneak. We're gonna have to sneak a little bit better than this. Okay, did he go back to bed? No, oh, he's right fucking there. This is impossible. How the fuck do we sneak into this stupid guy's house? They should all be asleep right now, but they're not. Okay. Let's go in through the outhouse route. It's a little a little back way that only I know about. Oh my god. Look at all of these teats. Holy shit, we're never gonna get a chance like this ever again, guys. Stay asleep. <laughs> oh god. Okay. I think we've avoided some of the dogs. Okay, let's lockpick our way in. Find the sweet spot. No. Oh, are you serious? It's meant to be an an easy one. Okay, we're in. Okay, where's Sleeping Beauty? Okay. He's there, he's asleep. We're trespassing. I, I realize this game. Okay, now where is this lockbox? It looks like the dogs... Okay, let's eat his dinner as well. Hey, who's that? Oh, fuck, come on, really? Oh, shit. He heard us eating his... Eating his dinner. Oh, lucky for us, he didn't see our torch. <laughs> Okay, where's the lockbox? Does anyone know? Oh, it's right here. Okay. Okay, we're in. Okay. Sips, you need to give the dogs your meat. Love your streams, Dad. Fuck, it's not here. There's an old shirt here. Okay, let's take this bludgeon because we don't actually have a weapon. Come here. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Jesus! He snuck up on me! Fuck me! That scared the sh- Oh, for fuck's sakes. We're dead. Fuck! That scared the Christ out of me! Oh my lord. Oh god, that... The unarmed combat is terrible, though. He followed... Take that. Goodbye! What? Did you just say Jabate? Fuck it. Fuck you. Fuck. Take this. Oh, you son of a bitch. It's impossible. It is the. I'll squash you like the louse you are. It's fucking impossible. The unarmed combat's fucking impossible. You've no business here. Clear off. Jesus, look where you're going. What the fuck? Really? 
The ring wasn't there. Come on. Fucking son of a bitch. Now you've had it. Oh shit. Fuck. It's time to bludgeon your ass. Executioner Herman. You hey, what do you think you're doing? Get the hell out of here. I will not. I will not. Take that. You can't block a bludgeon. We're constantly up along here. It's not there. <laughs> How is this? <laughs> Why the fuck am I um? Okay, you know what? One more try. It turns out it's impossible to bludgeon this man. Oh, we're getting him now. He's, he's weakened. Stop with the fucking grapples! Fuck! Fuck me! This I'm locked in this fucking grapple with this guy. Oh, for fuck's sake! This is so fucking annoying. Fuck! I'm not backing down. Fucking take this, you bitch! Oh, fuck the grapples. The combat is fucking terrible. I fucking hate this. How is he not dead? Are you serious? Fuck, are you fucking serious? How the fuck are you still alive? There, finally. Okay, let's mercy kill him now as well. What is this? Move exactly. I'm fucking almost dead. This ring is not here. This uncle's an asshole. What the fuck? It's nowhere. Oh, it's in here, I guess. Oh, fuck, it's in there. Fuck. Fuck's sake. I think we're bleeding and dying. We have one health left. Oh, shit. Fuck it. No. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Where are you going? Come on, Betsy. Oh wait, maybe it's in here. Fuck, there's multiple chests, actually. I don't understand how the guy woke up in the first place. Fuck's sake. Fuck's sake. God, he took a real hammering before he ran off, too. We're just gonna bleed out and die, I guess. How is this game? Man, the combat when you don't have a sword is god-awful. It's fucking impossible. But otherwise, it's pretty cool. Alright, dog. Come and finish me off. Where is he? There he is. You shut your mouth. Stop it. Right now. There's only one thing we can do. We just have to take a little breather, I think. Oh, just channel your inner pan flute quickly. I know. It, it was a it was a rough one. I I apologize. I apologize for that. I wasn't expecting him. People have noticed my bad behavior. God damn it! What? 